Hello YouTube and welcome, I am Windraiser and today I'm bringing you a, um, I think I do today a Power Rangers review. Now this is two figures, um, that I have with me. Make sure I pulled it out of my storage locker. So today we are going to look at the Power Rangers Lightspeed Rescue. Lightspeed Train. So here is number one. I have one through five. So I'm gonna take a look at them all day later because these are things that's huge. Give me four, three, six, and get on and everything. I love these guys. I really do. These are very cool. I do know the side of the detail. Uh, they do have these little laser cans that pull out. Very cool. Um, and each one does have a hitch on the back. So, you get the hitch here. Here it looks like a very hitch up. Uh, have to do it. We have pulled this hitch out and just latching it on there. So they can latch up with each other. Um, uh, yep, even he has one in the front. So he has a latch too, which is this little pin. Now each one has a another Megazord sitting inside. That's why these guys are heavy from when I'm holding them. So you just get this little lever here. Open it out. And I had sort of inside the uh, Omega Flyers. And these store in just like you would the Shoot on it. Wow, you just pop that off. Uh, one second. That's never happened before. There we go. So you can have you know, these, either these guys, or the rescue zords inside. So I'm going to go and pull these out. And um, he can't, these guys can't come on with these inside. So it goes up. And close. There we go. And yes, mine is missing two little things. Only the red and blue are missing those. Now they're like. <laughs> Alright, so I'm off inside. Come on to Rescue Train 2. I think it's kind of like a box car. Someone post uh, did the names of these things. I forgot what they were called. So I'm gonna go open it up on the side. Inside we have Rescue Two or uh, Omega Two. So I'll bring him out. Close him up. Got these. A very very light frame. Like even the de underside is detailed. Like that is really cool. You don't see that. Let's have trade doors. Alright. Now we're going to number three, which is by far to me the weirdest train I have seen. Like it, it has this and then it has this, but this is a Japanese speed train, so it's going to have the two ribs and cockpits. Very cool. Again, underside, very detailed. I didn't have to add that little extra bit, but they did. And him, he has, you open this part up right here, pull out either Rescue 3 or Omega 3, which I have stored inside of him. To be quite frank, I like Omega 3. Like, even the, even the inside, 
of that little hatch is detailed. There's number three right there. That, that is really cool. So I'll go ahead and close that up. And then you have Omega 3 bending gear to plug. I'm going to set him right next to my computer. Um, I'm going to go ahead and show you off the uh, Omegas while I have them out with their landing gear all deployed. And their weapons ready. Now, there's Omega Rescue 2. Landing gear, fucking deploy it. Number one. Ooh. Yeah, that's the only problem I have with my Omega 1. One of the wings. I don't know if I did this in my last in my review of him before. But his wing is starting to crack right there. I don't know how they can see it. There he is, ready to fly. Alright, next we have Lightspeed Rescue Train number four. Like I like how beefy these trains are. Like these ones these ones have the doors in the back. Uh yep, underbelly also designed very well. Very well detailed design. Sorry. And then with her we have Omega Rescue Four. Now mine needs missing pieces. Literally. <laughs> One second. Okay, the only piece that he, this one's missing is the piece that would fit here. Yeah. I can always replace her by finding one on eBay. Mm. Yeah, you have her. There you go. We'll take her. Her new Zord is off the side. Why does my phone keep going off? And now we have Rescue 5 Train Pink. Yes, they're all black, but that shows the color indication for you, which is cool. And we have, yep, more detail underneath. Inside, we have Omega Pink, which back then, Pink Swords were always white, but red and pink. Okay. Her and yellow are kind of the same, except she's got longer skids. This is the piece I'm missing on yellow. If anyone can help me find this piece, just this die cast piece, or another one to replace her, I'd greatly appreciate it. Um, oh yeah, I want to keep this side. They even detail the ramps, so the ones that open the side that have these little ramps to extend. So, I told you that each, that the Zord, the Lightspeed Rescue, the Super Trade Megazord, can combine with the Omega or the Lightspeed Rescue Megazord inside of them. That is true. My phone needs to set it off. But so in order to do that first Yeah, we'll do that first. So I'm gonna take each Omega Zor and I'm gonna slide them back into their uh, respective carry zords.
right, now I combine them. Blue, red, the front's off. Come to the back here. And we'll push this piece over round like it plug it down. So basically this little C clip here, that little clip there, plug into place. Take this piece and see these clips here, and plug onto into those. Like so. There we have this one arm. Or you can do it in There you have the other arm. Put this up to the side. Next we'll come to I like to do pink and yellow. So take them, grab here and here, hold them up, push down, and this little connector peg will pop out. These little uh, wheels here, fold them up, and I like how that everything clicks solidly into place. Like so. Next, we'll come to this piece here, split it open, that way. We can move this forward, plug it right there. So now we have the torso. So we'll go ahead and merge them up. And we have pink, yellow, red. Oh, this is heavy. And blue. And now the epic head reveal. This little piece here will clip into there. And we raise up the horns. There you have the Super Train Megazord. And you can see this thing again is huge. Um, I'm going to set him up near something. And I'm going to get <laughs> my biggest Transformer Tidal Wave. And my Beast Hunters, Optimus Prime, and stand him next to him. And I'm going to move the camera so you guys can see how big this guy is. This guy is huge. You can see how big this guy towers them. He's massive. I love this figure. Come here. Oh, you are heavy. So, out of all of the Megazords I now own, this guy is the biggest one of them all. Um, you can extend all these bits if you want to give him, like I said, gun mode everything or just pop the front here fold that down and you have missile launchers and then this is um, I think it's a flamethrower or just a giant uh, bean cannon in the show so there you guys go uh, I'll bring it over here now yeah there we go Ooh. Beefy. <laughs> so there you guys go. This is the Power Rangers Light Speed Rescue Super Train Megazord. I'm Wood Razor, and I'll catch you guys next time. God, you're heavy. You're digging in my